Basically, Mr. Javik, I'm um, an artist, an Afrobeat artist, and uh, what I do is I uh, sing, I rap, I'm a songwriter, um, I do a lot of things, do you understand? I'm a performer, just a song up, I'm an entertainer. Um, basically, music business, um, I was sitting down with um, AU Beats like. AU Beats in UK is doing a lot of big things now for people like Tiny Tempo, DJ Ronick and a couple of other big arts and I got down in the studio and we were talking about doing something because um, at that point in time um, uh, Fino and Olami they came out with two called Ghost Mode so I was thinking I was sitting there with um, um, AU Beat and we decided to, to start thinking of something that would, would be great for the UK like in that terms, in that department so we, Ayo was saying something about music, music, and I came up with, like, how about we just come up with something like music business? And then we started working on the beat, and it started sounding sick. And at that time, Como was doing, Como was out with a song called um, African Woman, he was doing big things. So I called him and I let him come down, let's sit down together and smash it. He came down, I would put it down, and we nailed it. And now, in Nigeria, they all to all the biggest blogs are picking it up, and people are loving it. It's trending everywhere now. The music video is out now and everybody's going crazy about it. And it's a viral video by the way. But it's really it's getting a good reception at the moment, yeah. Maybe actually it's a difficult question, but like I think with what I'm trying to do and where I'm trying to go, I, I think I'm looking to be the king in Afro Do you understand? Like uh, like I've seen a lot of general music, I've done a lot of things, R&B, pop, dance, but like going back to the roots, Africa, and just doing this Afri um, Afrobeat thing, like um, looking at my resume and what I'm doing and people I'm working with and the web, the kind of hard work I put into what I do, I, I don't really see anyone like, w w when I get in there I don't really see anyone stopping me, so I'm, I'm kind of looking at myself as after Fela, Fela Kuti as you all know is the Afrobeat king, the king of Afrobeat, um, the nest is me really. So that, I'm not really bragging, but you know, I let my work speak for itself, really. Um, my team. Anyway, big up, big up, big up, my team. Um, Nawao Entertainment from Nigeria, big teams. Uh, basically, they've just called me and said to me they've had music business and is doing this thing, but they know that I do singing and they know that the ladies want something a bit more soft. So I thought, okay, yeah, I'm gonna drop a chill because uh, one of the biggest producers in the way in Nigeria at the moment just hollered at my team and decided to do a track. I was calling that Mama Sita, so I sat down with AOB to, to do like a co production work. So now I'm featuring AOB on this track called Mama Sita that will be out at the ending of this month. It's crazy, the beat is crazy. AU killed it, and uh, we're about to do a crazy video to it as well and kill it at the same time. So this year I'm just gonna be dropping like I know a lot of artists they like they like pull out track and take like one or two months and pull like with me like I say because the way I'm coming and what I want to chill people is like for me music is music I'm just putting it anyhow I feel like this this music business is big with Como but I'm not sitting on that we're coming with something hard soon as this soon as this Mama Sita track drops at the end of this month. I've already got my team, I've just did a deal with, um, just hollered at T-Pain management and they've just sent a track to collaboration between me and T-Pain. That will be out in summer as well. And not to forget the song, I Love Africa, the video will be coming out in summer. So there's a lot of things, man, it's big. It's, it's just crazy, a lot of things. So I'd like you guys to watch out and stay locked. Harder, harder. I can give you your desire, that's why it's loving me. I know you hate me because the ladies loving me. Oh yeah, they love Which is pretty much the same time Mama City will be coming out and it's gonna be Walthamstone, Walthamstone, Walthamstone Hall. Um, everything, every direction I'm actually gonna be putting it up on site on my website, which is www.2jintent.com. So on there you get the information about the 
the, the, the event. It's a big show. It's there's a big show. We're representing and supporting a charity for um, African children back back home and trying to put money together for schools in Africa. Children, children in Sierra Leone, another part of Africa that don't really have the, enough for school facilities. So this show is just really just to put funds together for it. But in my website um, on Twitter. There will be like more information about what this show is about, what it represents, what I'll be doing. We have over about seven to ten thousand audience for this event, so it's a massive one this March, and a lot of people are coming down. So I'd like you not to check my website out, get the details, book, just book for your own ticket and come through, and you'll love it, man. It's gonna be, it's gonna be mad. I'll be performing. Um, I love Africa, which is one of my singles this summer. I'm gonna be performing Mama Seat, but this is the hottest track coming out this summer as well. So look out for that big thing still. Uh, it bro, it's really, it's really like it's not but the, for me I just think like I wanna I'm, I'm a natural, you know, like I've been someone who love family kids and everything and like they inspire me to ride they inspire me to walk out like we all know nowadays like if you got a kid you know you can't mess up you know you can't like you can't be a failure you want to motivate your kids so like that kind of makes me all the time it motivates me so i, I kind of have a schedule with the mom so i'm always scheduling myself is if i'm at work I know when the mom is out and back home and look after my baby, then I got a call for an interview, then I got a call to travel to something like the other day my team just called me because we were talking to um, T Pain and the uh, we were actually talking to T Pain regarding the new track that is coming out as well. They just called me and booked a flight straight to um, South Africa the other the other week. It was just crazy like that. I just keep getting calls and I, and I can't say no. But it's good that I have a good family that I can able to be like a good dad and look after my kids. And if I'm not there, the mom is there to look after the baby. And I'm out and doing my stuff. So it's still flexible. I'm a very flexible and very hardworking guy. So I kind of managed to put this all together so nicely. So but the journey I'm about to take you guys through is, is ridiculous. It's crazy. Like the kind of performances I'm looking to pull out. Like I see the P Square, the Nyaya, the Whiz Kids, and and Two Face, which I respect. But like what I'm bringing to the table, this 2014 is is beyond, is beyond, is beyond this what this F can can, can take, man. So these guys just watch out for Mr. J. It's going down, man. For real. Okay, um, my plans for my new, my, I'm actually, I'm actually looking to just, my team, anyway, big up again to my, my new team, which are just like really representing at the moment in Nigeria, they're taking over, um, Nawa Entertainment, big up, um, they're actually setting up uh, a good launch party for me, I think that is um, 2015 actually, early 2015, so like this year, really and truly, I'm just working on dropping a couple of singles out, and then by the end of this year, she put an, uh, she put the EP, she put EP out, which would be like a couple of five tracks. Where I love African couple, um, couple of tracks in that, and put that out. Then 2015, we should be looking to drop a very crazy album. Now, if you want to listen to my my music, or watch my videos on YouTube, it's very very simple. You could just type Mr. J A Y V I C, which is Mr. J V C and a lot of my tracks will come I've done I, I, like I said I, I rap I sing I dance I, I've got a couple of hip hop hip hop up, fusion with afro beats I've got um i uh, got a couple of R&B stuff with a fusion of afro beat as well like it, everything is on YouTube like if also you want to check my website it's www.2jent.com or you can check me on SoundCloud which is Mr. Javik everything is Mr. Javik my Twitter is Javik official so once you check that you should be able to, to, to get my tracks and listen to it man and all I'm saying is listen to my track drop your comments support me because we about to take over Afrobeat is going global it's going bra it's just do you understand so once again I just want to big up AOB that makes it possible for us to sit down in the studio I work with crazy producers and put crazy crazy records out. I want to big up my boy Como as well. Obviously, I can't do this interview without bigging big up album, album, album Flash. They're the biggest, biggest, biggest TV online. They're doing big things for a couple of artists in the UK. 
check it out good videos out soon i'll be dropping some mad videos with, with, with them as well so i want to rep you a lot for coming down to my house to do this beautiful interview it's a nice one bro